Welcome to Lady Oklahoma for the 2020 Clay's Cartridge Company PRC. This is the National Rifle League's 12th match of the 2020 season, hosted by Clay Blackadder and Tate Streeter. This match sends the NRL to Oklahoma where shooters are competing at a brand new venue for the league and a course of fire co-designed by last year's NRL champion. Oklahoma is a state notorious for its high winds and extensive precision rifle history. This weekend, we will be following one squad as they take on 20 stages across two days. With their fierce turnout and championship caliber match directors, anything is possible. You're watching the 2020 Clay's Cartridge Company PRC. As the competitors settle in, our squad begins at stage three. Yeah, that's crazy. Yeah. Impact! 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 What time I got? 30 seconds. I gotta watch yours. Something went wrong with that timer. It's not ready. You're now at 30 seconds. Right now? Yeah. 30, 25. Impact. Impact. Good run, Austin. Good job, brother. That's about right there. That was clean, wasn't it? Yeah. Did you go to, how far right did you hold? Clean. Did you go to that? Ten feet. Thank you, sir. What'd you say? How far right were you holding? Hey guys, Austin Norgan here. We are at Clay Cartridge PRC in Leedy, Oklahoma. Uh, we're two stages in. First stage was a troop line going out to about 750. Uh, the next stage is a 10 round stage off of a bunch of tires. So far so good. The weather's great. Beautiful day in Oklahoma. Hey, it. Jeremy. It just went left. Yeah. I, I don't know. I, I, I think you were getting slighted. My, my, my zeros went low. Well, then I would have had a chance. I'd probably have had a chance to everything. And if you were holding high on the far one, you're still low. It may be a little bit of loss. Of course, it's pretty cool this morning. Yeah. Three runners are such slow. I'm not going to mess with that. But I'd, I'd add a tenth of my zero. Or at least add a tenth to everything. I've seen it. Now I kept favoring. Yep. And then there's actually three targets right along that rock. There's one right here at the edge, second, and then the third one just off the edge of it. So, find the targets, go up and to the left. Thanks, sir. Any questions on this stage? Everybody got it? All right. Impact. 
pack. Impact. Come on! That's left. Yeah, it's left. That, that bullet splash was just inside the left edge. Perfect. Right. Went off the left. Where'd you hold? Oh, I dropped the ball over there. Did you rush that last shot? Because you weren't it's that far from center on the first one. I felt like I pulled the clean, but it's a dang scope you got. You hold on that last one. John Kyle Tripp from Watumpka, Oklahoma. We just. Uh, just shot a, a five target stage, five different positions, shooting in prone on a hillside. Uh, went clean to the last shot, was watching my watching my shots and just made a made a bad correction on the final final target. Held a, held a little bit too much left and sent it off the side, but overall uh, it's not a, not too tough of conditions yet for uh, for Oklahoma. So, but we'll get there today, I promise. John, is that what you're seeing? Low right. Uh, yeah. Impact. That was fairly center low. Impact. I have nothing wrong, Corey. Were they hitting right? Yeah. Yeah. No. Yeah, no. I was holding center, so I think my zero low. Where were they? I'm, I'm so far over there. But I'll take it. We're going to shoot two rounds each target, hit or miss, and then move to the next position and next target. You can start at whichever rock you want to start at. You can do the rocks in any order. The targets have to be shot near to far, left to right. Has everyone seen where the targets are? That first target is that little sliver of field, if you haven't seen it. First target's next to the big sign from number seven. All the rest of them are up and to the right along that sliver of field. All, transact all transitions will be made bolt back. I want you to come in, I'll tell you when to put your bolt in, or put your mag in, and uh, keep your chamber flag on you, because when you finish, you have to drop your bolt, put your chamber flag in. Hi, my name is Connor Dieter. I'm from Texas. I just shot the rock stage at Clay's match in Lady, Oklahoma. Ended up cleaning it. Pretty fun stage. Pretty fun match so far. Impact! Impact! Keep the flag in, please. Start on either side, I don't care. Okay. Questions? What's the right position? They're all marked. They're marked. Yeah, especially here. Nine
Jake Bibber here from Washington State. One thing I like about this stage is it makes you think. All the stages are completely different. Hi, Regina Milkovich. I'm from Arizona. That was pretty challenging. I didn't think I was going to be able to finish that well. So, so far, it's been a fun match. Carson Rutherford from Elk City, Oklahoma. I'm at the Heat Stroke Open. It was pretty difficult. High wins, fast mover. Heading into day two, the squad continues at stage 11. It has a four on it, and one to the right, and we're shooting the left target. So we're shooting uh, right, right to left. left. And you are shooting right to left, left but the left target. <laughs> okay. Any questions? Bag in, bolt back, be sure you put the flag in. One foot in the box, one toe in the box. All equipment in hand. What one? Nice run, sir. You made it look easy. Good. Hello, I'm Isaiah Curtis, uh, shooting the uh, Clay's Cartridge Company NRL match this weekend. It's day two. Uh, been through two stages so far this morning. Uh, so far, everything's working well. Uh, we did a little, Clay did some restructuring last night, so our squads split up. Uh, so the top eight shooters are shooting with each other. The next eight are shooting with each other, et cetera, et cetera, on down the line. Yesterday went fairly well. Uh, I think I ended up in third, third overall yesterday, um, but that's just day one, so we'll see what today brings and hope to not drop any shots today. hit twice to move so two hits move two hits move two hits move last target has a flasher if somebody wants to get on glass and look target four is the only one I did. I'm not catching trace every time but everything is pretty good. thank you for our Owen
guess not. I held a, I held a little, that first one looked a little low that I hit, but I just went ahead and shot it again. I mean, it looks like, it looks like it. Where your back stops about 100 yards back where it's actually landing. They had a parachute on the rail end of it. I didn't hold much or anything, but yeah, a little bit. I was, didn't even come. I was closer to the center than I was the edge. So I'm out here at Clay's Cartridge Company match in Leedy, Oklahoma. Day two right now. Day one was pretty good for me. I cleaned most of the stages, but there's a couple that hurt me a little bit. I was sitting eight, so I barely made the cut for squad one for today. Just shot stage six. Dropped one off the bottom edge. I don't know how. I guess my dad didn't know how to put enough powder in a bullet or something. Oh well, but it went pretty good. I got a nine on it, so I'm not too disappointed. If you take one shot and you hit your first one, and you take your second shot and you miss, and you don't move, and you shoot again, or a third shot from this position, I am not going to correct you before you take the shot. What I will call is move. That's your, that's your note that you didn't move on that shot, that's why you didn't get the point. Move your position, All right? But now you're only going to take one shot from that next position. Does that make sense? It's a little bit screwy, so do yourselves a favor. Don't miss, because that's the best way not to get out of order. So got That's good. I wonder if it's worth running a tripod on. Got plenty of time. trying to do is hold on to a giant lead. Right? Exactly right. He just can't have the ball and he'll win by a point tomorrow. Impact! Impact! fun stage so um, Austin gave up a couple gave us a little bit of breathing room to catch up so so far so good we're in a fun squad first time I've ever um, they took the standings from yesterday from start to finish and moved everybody um, squatted everybody accordingly the scores yesterday which is kind of cool so first time I've done that kind of a different experience getting to shoot with some guys we weren't shooting with yesterday so but pretty nice for relatively close to Oklahoma and pretty nice weather so good time
All right, guys, and we are here with our top young gun, Mr. Connor Jeter. Connor, congratulations. Thank you, sir. Thank you, man. Back-to-back -back matches for you, back-to-back -back wins. That's huge, congratulations. There were a, a handful of young guns out here this weekend. I was watching all of you. All of you were shooting very well. How was the match for you? How, did you feel any pressure? I mean, uh, no, not really. Just trying to focus on myself and trying to hit my shots. I wouldn't worry about anybody else. Strong mental game, just hyper focus. Yep. Nice. Now, I know you have a handful of matches coming up. Is there anything that you're focused on specifically? No, not in particular. Just trying to do my best every match and get better and better. Simple, man. Simple. I love it. Keeping it straightforward, focused. You're doing an awesome job. I'm super proud of you. I can't wait to see you guys or see you compete at the next match. Thank you. Thank you, sir. All right, guys, and we are here with our top lady, Miss Stacy Hesser. Stacy, congratulations! Thank you, thank you very much. Back Appreciate to it. back, top lady in our row. Yay! Yay! And in your home state. Yes, yes. Most oh, importantly, right? I got, a, I got, a, I got territory to defend here. You got territory to defend. There are some ladies out here gunning for you. Oh yeah, I know. So there you go. <laughs> some stiff competition. How was the match for you? Really good. Uh, day one, it was amazing. I yeah. The, the wind gods and myself, we came into alignment. Today we were a little shaky, but it was still really, really good. Good and venue, good venue. Awesome venue. Now, don't correct me if I'm wrong. This is also the first time you beat a certain somebody in a national level match. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody's like, is it going to be a bad ride home? It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> oh, heck yeah. Heck yeah. Congratulations. Thank you. Rub it in his face. He's got to do dishes for the month. <laughs> <laughs> that man knows how to do dishes. <laughs> he knows how to get him in a sink. But yeah. Is that right? So, what's your schedule like for the rest of the year? I know you, you've gotten your necessary matches. Yep. You qualified for the championship. I mean, especially now back to back yeah. wins, right? Uh, so, there's no doubt there. Are, do you have more matches lined up for the rest of the year? I know it's a crazy just club. Year. Yeah, club just club stuff. stuff. Yeah, okay. so I'm really looking forward to that. Awesome. Yep. So you're gonna make us wait to see your awesome performance again at the championship. Yeah. Yes. Time yes. to practice. Yes. Yeah. Dry okay. fire, baby. Yeah. There you go. Congratulations. Thank I'm so you. proud of you. Thank you so much. Thank you. All right. All right, guys. We are here at the 2020 Clay's Cartridge PRC, and with our champion, relaxed and cool, Mr. Austin Orgain. Austin, congratulations. Thanks, sir. buddy. It's been a long time since we've seen you out of match. Yep. Work, life, everything's going crazy. Yeah. How's it feel? Uh, man, it feels good. Uh, you know, I was planning on shooting a lot more NRO this year. The whole COVID deal kind of messed everything up for everybody, switching jobs. Right. Uh, it's just been a little bit tough to make it. And, uh, you know, it feels good. This one's close to home. Not far to go. I get to sleep in my own bed. It's really nice to come out and, and have a good day. Have a good couple of days, I guess. Good couple of days. Now, from what I was told, you only dropped 11 points yeah. all weekend. Yeah. You haven't shot a national level match in quite a while. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's, uh, it's been a few weeks anyway. Right. It's been a real long time, but yeah. Okay. I haven't shot in a little while. Um, you know, I, and I actually haven't practiced either. I kind of planned on shooting. 30 or 40 rounds for a couple of days last week leading up to this and it just didn't really happen. Uh, you know, getting home late, I had, got really busy at work and you just kind of got to go in with the mental toughness to be able to kind of grind through it. And, and, you know, really most of the time, the first couple of stages are, are the ones that kind of knock the rust off and get going. Unfortunately, I, you know, we were able to shoot prone and do some stuff that are more of my strong suit. So I was able to get by that and knock the rust off jitters shaking out and it just got in a groove and kept rolling. Smooth sailing from there. Yeah. Well, congratulations, sir. This concludes the 2020 Clay's Cartridge Company PRC. Congratulations to Austin Orgain for taking first place in the match. The NRO would also like to congratulate Quinn Rogers and John Pinch for taking second and third in the match, as well as many other great competitors close behind them. Thank you to the match directors, ROs, sponsors, competitors, and everyone else who helped make this match possible. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe to stay up to date on all NRO news and content. As always, stay safe, keep shooting, and we'll see you all next time.